some great things from Sephora. I am actually going to be doing a tutorial on this. Um, I'm hoping to have it up by this week because I want it out before the movie comes, but I am going to be doing a 50 Shades of Grey makeup tutorial. What I got from Sephora is the new Makeup Forever Professional Pairs. It is the 50 Shades of Grey um, kit. This one comes with the box and the eyeshadow palette, the mascara, the eyeliner, um, the gloss, and the lipstick. So let's open this up. Oh my gosh, they really went all out on this packaging. Oh my goodness, just look at that. They wrapped it all up in tissue paper. Let's see. Wow. Holy moly. Ooh, give in to Gray. Mr. Gray will see you now. Wow, that's really pretty. So this is what it looks like. It's really pretty. They've got, ooh. Oh wow. You can use this for like a little jewelry box or something. This is really cool. It's got a little opening with a key lock right there. It's got a mirror in here. And then here is the eyeshadow palette. It's very sleek looking. And then these are the eyeshadows. They're really pretty. So it's got like a, a oh my goodness, these are freaking creamy. Um, let's see if I can swatch these out for you guys. How do I, how do I want to swatch these? <laughs> I need to work with my swatching. This is like ridiculous. Okay, so I'm going to swatch it right here. Try to get that one away. All right. So here's the first one. As you can see, it's a very creamy highlight color. This one is a bronzy, taupey brown, as you can see there. This one looks more gray right here, and it looks more matte. It's like a grayish purplish is coming off of, huh? That one is, how do I do this, right here? So this next one is a, a grayish purplish color. It doesn't have much sheen in that one. This one looks like oh, it's almost matte, so it would be a great for the crease. And then this one is, ooh. This one's like almost like a olive green light, like a, it's got like an olive green tint to it. Nice, pretty shimmer. These things are very, very pigmented. And they've got a different type of texture than I've ever felt in an eyeshadow. So this would be a very interesting look to do. I'm like looking at myself in the mirror. How do I look? <laughs> no, but this would be, um, these eyeshadows have a very different type of texture than I've ever experienced. Um, I really, I can't wait to do a look with these. This is gonna be very interesting. It'll be interesting to see if they are very blendable and they are very pigmented, so you have to use a light hand, but they're, they look all to be very shimmery. The only one that looks matte is this one right here. And that's like the purplish grayish one. But yeah, these will be fun. Then it came with a lipstick and this lipstick is Rouge Artist Natural N4. The packaging is really pretty. As you can see here, it's more of a darker tone. Ooh, they're creamy. So that's what the lipstick looks like. It's kind of a dark, rosy nude. Whoop. That's pretty. Then they also came with a lip gloss. And this is Lip Gloss D14. It's got a nice little shimmer to it. It's, um... It's a clear gloss with a little bit of shimmer. As you can see, it's right above the lipstick. It's got a little bit of a pinky tint to it, but it's pretty much clear. 
Also, they have the graphic liner. Ooh, I didn't know it was this. It's a um, eyeliner pen, like, you know, Kat Von D's Trooper. I really need, oh my God, this thing is black. Like, wow. Wow. I can't wait to use this. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh my goodness, that is black. Now I wonder how well it stays. So I'm gonna let it dry and then I'm gonna see if I can move it around and see if it still smudges. But wow, oh my goodness. It's the graphic liner. Wow, alrighty. I can't wait to use that. That is like really, really black. That's blacker than the Kat Von D Trooper one. Okay, so the other thing is the Makeup Forever Mascara and this is what the brush head looks like. Gosh, what's up with these brush heads lately? They're like huge. So it's got like a dome and oh my goodness, this must be very volumizing. It's smoky extravagant. That will be a fun one to try. So as you can see, here's the packaging for this one. Very pretty. They came also with a booklet right here with, um, with a ton of different makeup looks that you can do with the palette. Oh, these are cool. That's a really neat smoky eye right here. Maybe I could try something like that because as you guys know, I'm very, very basic with my eyeshadows, so maybe I'll kind of branch out and try something a little bit bolder looking. <laughs> so the next thing that I got is the Makeup Forever Create Your Look of Desire with three shades of cheek color to wear at will. So this one is the blushes. It comes with three blushes. I, three blushes or two blushes and a highlighter. It comes, let's see, Cheeky Blush Trio. Comes with a brush as well. Again, the packaging is gorgeous. Alrighty. So here it comes. Oh, how cute. Oh my goodness. This came with a little bag and it has a key on it and it says make it forever. Oh, that is so cute. How neat. And then you could just tie it right there. Oh my God, that is so cool. Wow. Alrighty. And then wrap up in tissue paper. And this, let's see this brush. You can never have too many makeup brushes. <laughs> So this one is a little bit of an angle. It's very soft. Huh, that'll be interesting to use um, for a blush, a blush brush. And here is the trio right here. Let's see if that's gonna focus. And it has, I think, yeah, this is a highlight shade right here. Holy moly, these things are pigmented. Um, I'm gonna put that right there on my arm. As you can see, I am putting them, I swear, I need to work with swatches and being able to find it on there, right here. Here it is. <laughs> there we go, Madison, let's do it. All right, so this is a highlighting shade, it looks like. Be very careful, it's very, um, very highlighting, very sheeny to it. Might have a chance of getting a little bit too chalky, but if you use the light hand, you should be okay. This is more of a sheeny, like a very pink, um, pink blush right next to it. Right here, that's really pretty. And then here's more orangey color. As you can see right here. That's really pretty too. She uses, she in her makeup look, she's very simple, but she does have like a little bit on her cheeks, so these are really pretty colors for that. I'm gonna try these out, so as you'll see in my tutorial, I will basically be a first impressions, and we'll see how these work out. The last one I got from Sephora is the Makeup Forever Tease Me Passionate Berry Lip Trio. So it comes with a lip liner, a lip gloss, and I think two lip glosses. Let's see what this looks like. Again, wrapped really beautifully. Okay, I swear, look at my arm. It's like, 
freaking crazy with swatches right now. Alrighty, let's figure out a place where to swatch this. So this is the Make It Forever Aqua Lip in 10C, I believe. It's a very berry color. Ooh, it's very creamy, as you guys can see. It's right here. Very, very creamy. Then they also here have um, aqua, aqua Rouge. And this side, it looks like a, almost like a lip stain right here. It's a berry lip stain. Very pigmented gloss. That's why I think it's almost like it reminds me of a stain. And then here it's the clear. It's just a clear coat. So I'm guessing this would, this is what goes on top. But it's just clear. You guys can't even see it. Yeah, this is shade, the berry part is shade 50. And then this is just clear. Then they also give you another lip gloss in here, and it's kind of a berry color, and it's got a lot of shine to it. It's got a lot of glitter in it. Oh, that's pretty. Very sticky, though. So again, for all you um, ladies out there that don't like sticky glosses, this probably is not for you. It's a very pretty color. It's a berry pink lip gloss, and it's got a lot of little glitters in it. It's very sheer, so that way you could also apply it on top of a lipstick or you can wear it by yourself. And it will just create a nice little berry tint to your lips. Let's see how, did this liner dry? Oh yeah, that liner is not going anywhere. Wow. Interesting. So that's the end of my haul. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to thumbs up this video and leave me any comments down below and let me know if you guys have tried out these products. Let me know your thoughts about them. Also, make sure to subscribe so that way when my Fifty Shades of Grey tutorial comes up, you guys can take a look at that. Alrighty? You guys all have a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! You got me sipping on something I can't compare to nothing I've ever known after this fever, I'll survive I know I'm acting up again